just trying to say that we attract who we are. See, That's what we attract is who we are. Definitely. You you have control over who you talk to, of course, and like you have control over who you interact with. But make sure you're disciplined in that fact. Like that, they gotta have the same mindset as you. If you don't, it's just gonna hold you back. You thought I was for you. That nigga a munch. Nigga eat a heat for lunch. Bitch on my body, I get what I want. Like you thought I was feeling you. Situated. I had to get some some hose water to put in the pool because it's bubbling, bubbling. I gotta get that. And then we got Daisy over here. Daisy over here cackling because she wants some some bugs in her food. When I say bugs, I mean she eats mealworms. She laid an egg today. Shout out to Daisy doing the dang thing. The wind blew everything open. A gust of wind decided to just blow everything. what she has in her bowls that le I left for her but she likes to eat these uh, mealworms and mix it in there I try to get some fresh ones for her but she'll get some fresh ones on Thursday she wants some time for Thursday because that's when I get paid so I can get her some more food food that she'll like maybe some different food just so that she could eat more green and plant based some mealworms doubt you wanted to see that but that's what she eats there you go baby here you go yeah and i'm gonna put this egg in the fridge i didn't want to go to the gym but if i don't go it's a waste so i should go Get ready to leave. Got sprayed by this water, but I'm getting ready to go. I'm trying to vlog once a day and post it. So today marks day two, but we'll see how everything comes to. You know, hopefully we get it done. But I'm not gonna put too much pressure on myself because I also did tell myself three times a week is fine for me. But I feel like it's redundant to put this one breaker on. I ain't going with you, but. I be cold, so I'm gonna wear it. So I guess it'll be. It's cute too, I like it, so. We gonna wear it. Um, pack up. I got three phones, one for the, one for the, oop. All right, I'll put these in my bag. Where is my watch? I think I left it in the car. I hope I left it in the car. No, I think I left it on the, on the kitchen table. Gotta grab the tripod. Okay, I gotta take all of them with me. No one wants to do that, but here we are. Cause I use one to keep track of like my speed on the road, and then another one for directions, and then another one for like B-roll, basically. But. So many liabilities in one bag. Wee, wee, wee. Front door open. I just press this little lock button. It locks the door for me because the keypad to get in. I put that in like a couple weeks back. You'll see it in the other. I think I didn't. I don't think I even like did a video for that, but I did put that in like, like a couple weeks back. Cause I was lazy and didn't feel like having to wiggle for my key anymore. I just put a keypad in there. Simple, kind of like the keypad I put in my room, but different, better, more secure. So we head to the gym now, cause I don't want to be a lazy bum. I don't want to be lazy. I wanna get these gains, and I'm like, if I don't go consistently, what's the point? You're not gonna see the gains, you're not gonna see the results. So you really gotta put that energy into it. So here we go, this is what time it is. 4.46, I'll get there by at least 5.15. At that, get back home by at least 6.15 is my goal, so. 6.30 the latest, but. Today we're doing legs, because I would really not wanna do them, so. We're gonna try to do them because I already did my upper back 
yesterday and I want to give my back some time to heal so if I do arms today it just wouldn't make sense we're gonna alternate body parts 32 minutes to get there as always just click bait like I'm not just playing uh let go have your traffic go to the gas and get some gas like put out your trunk hey yeah it come with a car huh what 25 is young what? 25 is old 21. until I'm 25 I don't know. I really think I should start talking in the car, but this, these little vlogs, these little vlogs, they might get monotonous. I'm trying to switch it up, but today we're going to the gym once again, and I'm trying to switch it up. I know Thursday and Friday I'm trying to be chilling, I'm trying to go pick up some shoes, but I might just go to GOAT and have them like ship it to me since it might be free. Like, I mean, they get free. I wish. It might be cheaper to do it that way. It's gonna take a little longer, maybe two weeks to get to me. But I know it'll be worth it because I want them so badly. But then if I get the shoes, I gotta get a fit to go with the shoes and I gotta go take pictures for sure. Um, so I gotta think about it all. But I'm definitely gonna get them. Like, I gotta get them, that's like the biggest thing I wanna get. There's this Mercedes Benz sitting there. Just sitting there. Just been sitting there for like, a minute and I really don't know if it's a good car or not but I just know it's cool like it looks nice like I like it I'm tired though I ain't gonna hold you I did not want to go to the gym I didn't want to go I don't want to go but I'm gonna be on my butt anyways doing these exercises gonna do them gonna hurt it's gonna hurt I'm not gonna like it but at least I'll have less stress on my my back especially in that area on my left side that i'm working on with pt at least it'll be less and i can still get a workout in i need to do it for my mental health so i will and honestly i need to do it for my physical like if i do it for the physical and i like the results i'm gonna feel more confident i'm gonna feel better about myself i might have better posture posture too at the end of the day like i might my posture might be get straighter I might be getting better but I don't understand this logic of my cheeks are forever going to be fat. Um, sometimes if I'm like 130 something, 120 something, I don't got no cheeks. It's skin. But if I get muscle, maybe, I'm just testing things. If, maybe if I get muscle, I'll have less chubby. Like I don't even know why I have chub. I'm on 48 right now. Usually I don't got chub right now. Usually I'm not chubby. But to me it's chub. Niggas might think this is regular life. This is ain't this ain't chub, but this is chub to me. I ain't clean these glasses. I didn't bring nothing to clean them. I had a good conversation today with one of my soon-to-be ex-coworkers. I met her today. She's leaving on Friday. So, but it was nice to like meet someone. I feel like I like having conversations with pretty much random random strangers because it just makes me feel like wait you live here I live here let's 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 talk about what this is and why we're here because honestly every day I need some meaning every day I need a purpose every day I need a newfound like reason to live because ask me again why ask me again you know but um I love it it's not negative I, I it's just for me I need to find reasons to live I need to find and that that thirst for life for me is what keeps me here the only reason I'm here is because I want to see something I want to see something I'm not gonna tell you what I want to see but I want to see something you're gonna see what I want to see at the end of the day you're gonna see it because I'm gonna make it happen but right now I'm just trying to get by but not really that's the thing I'm not trying to get by it's like that'd be dumb I'm trying to pursue my pa my passion, my purpose. And everybody's passing me because I can't go over 60. And that's fine with me. I can't I can't speed in this car, so gotta go what I gotta go. But I was just thinking about today, I was like, I really want that Jeep. That Jeep my mom has. I really want it. I want to have it. I want to own it. I want to be able to say it's mine. I don't know who's gonna hear this. I don't know where it, who's gonna even be intrigued by this. But consistency is something I really want to get into. Like, I was consistent as heck last year and I got some growth. But I want to be consistent in quality now. I want to be quality driven and consistent with it. But the thing is, how are you going to make quality and daily unless you have a team? And unless you have a team, 
and then it's like are you losing authentic are you losing authenticity when you're doing that i don't know it's, it's like something gotta give something gotta give and i'm still trying to figure out this marketing um commercial i just put out if you guys didn't check it out go on my instagram took some time making that i had really i had a fun time making it and i do want to continue trying to make videos like that for the series gotta finalize these clients gotta finalize these these uh interviewee these interviewees but i really want to make sure they know it's a podcast and more of a conversation between the both of us it's not just like we're on no jumper and we're just talking about you the entire time the entire time we're here to spark the conversation and like not only get your perspective and my perspective on things as well and that's why i'm opening up the conversation to you i'm opening up the conversation to you guys and like people that are in front of me or even like y'all that are watching like comment in the comment section if you guys want to be on a pod like you can get on discord and have and chop it up I have a discord and i really really want to get into using it more i really slacked on it last year um i do have people on there but i want to get more in there and i want to get females in there i got a lot of guys in there <laughs> i really want to talk to girls too but i don't really know if there's any girls that be on discord like that or even twitch it's really hard to find it's not that hard to find girls on twitch or people that you know game or things like that but to me it is i don't know if you just dm them on instagram if what do you do to find girls like just to ch chill girls like just to chill like nothing no weird no energy like that high key off women right now don't even want to don't even want to talk about it um they yeah, i'm gucci i don't even got time i guess that's too much mental pain and anger i don't i don't want to deal with right now too much energy then super super a lot so a lot of energy to deal with women a lot of energy to deal with my damn self so i can't even think about dealing with another person that is basically like me especially because that's what i like i don't want a person that's totally opposite from me even if you're a man so i don't want someone that's totally opposite from me you can't be you have to be similar to me it's, that's how it works like like attracts like right that's what it is so i'm trying to be my best self so that i can attract the best out of other people I don't like, yo, I have this, it's, honestly, it's, it's, I don't know if this is, it don't label me anything, but like, I don't like when quote unquote mediocre people are able to approach me and think they have a shot at me. I would rather be looked at as hard to get and don't even approach me. Like, I'm not even trying to be rude. I just rather be that. Like, maybe I just don't, I'm not standoffish or anything. I just don't really care. Like, I don't really care. And it takes me a lot to care of a shit, so... I'd rather be unapproachable. Don't even say hi. But I'm sweet. I'm sweet. I'm really nice. But don't take that as flirting. I said that we attract who we are. See, That's what we attract is who we are. Definitely. That's crazy. Like said, it doesn't matter the year or what. Yo, what's the new message? <laughs> <laughs> nigga, it's dead niggas out here that be calling niggas out here. You heard about what the, what's the new message? But That's niggas, insane. Like that. I didn't watch that, guys. Me. I didn't watch that. Just now, I, I like literally me, did not know he was about to say that. I promise you this is my first time watching this episode video that Quan put up and I'm saying to y'all like I do not want to be like everybody else so I cannot attract just a, a nobody a regular nigga I cannot attract why the you gonna wait for all these other cars but I swear like you like attract like like that's what it is if I'm a hustler you finna be a hustler if I'm a you know what I'm saying if I'm fine as hell you finna be fine as hell double time like you need to amplify me I gotta amplify you this like so many times like just now i did not know what he was gonna say but it's facts like you're going to attract what you are at the end of the day i don't want to be a fat bum so don't be a fat bum come and say hello to me do like you see i'm fit you see i'm put together you see i eat green and you see like don't even if you eat shit don't think you come eat shit with me because i don't eat shit bro i don't do that so and i apologize for the cursing and everything like that but like just to be real like I don't know, like, I, maybe, like, I wasn't allowed to curse as a child, and, like, now, I don't think if cursing is negative, I think if cursing is, like, they're just words, and they're just kind of, like, to me, like, an exclamation point to what I'm trying to say, that's what I see it as, it's exemplifying, no, I'm kidding, it's, anyways, it's just, it's just having, like, an exclamation point at the end of, like, what I have to say, but, facts, I hope you guys can hear me, I hope you guys see what I'm talking about, be yourself, and only be yourself. Do not attract people that you know you're not like. Like, I know you can't really be like, you, you, you have control over who you talk to, of course, and like you have control over who you interact with, 
but make sure you're disciplined in that fact. Like, know that if you work out five times a week, you gonna need a guy that works out five times a week, or plus, or more. Something that you can like rise to the occasion with. Someone's like, oh, like you want to make a business? I got five businesses already. I can show you how to make a business. Like someone that can push you on. Um, if not, build together. Like someone that someone that got the same mindset. Like they want to make a business, something like that. Like they gotta have the same mindset as you. Like because if you don't, it's just gonna hold you back. I've let go of a lot of different negative habits. And, like, there's some that I need to let go more of. Like, I need to practice more discipline. This is me going to the gym trying to practice discipline. And if I say I don't want to do something, I'm not going to do it. If I say I'm going to do something, I'm going to do it. So this is, like, what I'm trying to push on myself is to go even when I'm tired. Like, I was tired. I I woke up 5.30, something, took a shower, got to work at 7, 7.02. I was supposed to be there at 7 o'clock. I usually get there at 6.45. But this week... Since I got PTO the last two weeks, the last two days, for some reason I'm lazy this week because I know I, I don't really, I'm not working 40 hours. But I'm gonna be more, more on time, especially. Um, I forgot that I don't, I'm not even, I forgot that I have an appointment on Friday. I got two appointments on Friday. I forgot. I got two appointments on Friday. I don't know how I'm gonna make them. I'm gonna have to either reschedule them or figure something out. But yeah, like they were saying on all them like they don't they're not actual like scammers people think they are that's how that's how ridiculous it is like they make it so much money niggas be thinking they're they're scammers but it's whatever bro end of the day they don't get to this bag and they don't get it to the bag the right way and then they're showing kids how to get to it the right way like he's showing kids how to get to it. even if people will think this and think that he doesn't care about the perception. That's not what he's here for. He's also about God all the time. He wears the jewelry he wears. He believes in Jesus. Like he believes. He's. I don't know. If he, he never really said he's a Christian, but I believe. Like you know, if you're a follower of God, like somehow, you're Gucci, bro. You're good. You're good in the eyes of the Lord. You're fine. Like, I, I don't. I'm not here to like please man. I'm not here to please man. So if you have to cover your ears every time I curse, you have to do. That's your business. And that's your prerogative. Like, it's your prerogative to hinder, like, hide yourself from, and shield yourself from certain things in the world. It's your prerogative. That's your business. You do that. Do what you gotta do. That's the best thing that you can do. Like, do what you gotta do. One or two. Yeah, that nigga scam. We cook that too much. But do we know how, like, yo, what's the new method? We don't know nobody to call like that. A nigga was in my Discord. He, a nigga in my Discord. He you get what I'm trying to say? That we attract who we are. That's what we attract is who we are. That's crazy. It doesn't matter the year or what. But yo, what's the new method? <laughs> nigga, it's dead niggas out here that be calling niggas. That's insane. Like that. I didn't watch that, guys. I didn't watch that. Just now, I, I like literally me, did not know he was about to say that. I promise you, this is my first time watching this episode video that Quan put up, and I'm saying to y'all, like, I do not want to be like everybody else, so I cannot attract just a, a nobody, a regular nigga. I cannot attract. Why the heck did he just go red? Like, you can do that. He just went. He said, "Peace." He said, "Bye." Fuck the red light. I'm finna do the same. What you finna do? Nothing. Not a thing. Okay, great. That's not. That's why we don't do that. We gonna wait for all these other cars. But I swear, like you like attract like. Like that's what it is. If I'm a hustler, you finna be a hustler. If I'm a, you know what I'm saying. If I'm fine as hell, you finna be fine as hell double time. Like you need to amplify me. I gotta amplify you. See, this is the car that I was ju like just saying. Like that was the car I said that was just fly. He's driving it. That Mercedes Benz, he's driving. I know it ain't the one that was just parked over there, though. But that's the one that was just like, that's my fly. Randomly see, like, I swear, I be seeing synchronicity is heavy. Like, for me, that's just how life is. I be seeing synchronic synchronicities in my life ton, ton of times. Like, so many times. Like, just now, I did not know what he was going to say. But it's facts. Like, you're going to attract what you are. At the end of the day, I don't want to be a fat bum. So don't be a fat bum. Come and say hello to me. Do you, like you see I'm fit you see I'm put together you see I eat green and you see like don't even if you eat shit Don't think you come eat shit with me cuz I don't eat shit, bro. I don't do that so And I apologize for the cursing and everything like that, but like just to be real like I don't know like I maybe like I wasn't allowed to curse as a child and like now I don't think if cursing is negative I think if cursing is like they're just words and they're just kind of like to me like an exclamation point to what I'm trying to say. That's what I see it as. It's exemplifying. No, I'm kidding. It's anyways. It's just it's just having like an exclamation point at the end of like what I have to say. But facts. I hope you guys can hear me. I hope you guys see what I'm talking about. Be yourself. 
and only be yourself. Do not attract people that you know you're not like. Like, I know you can't really, like, con- you, can, you, you have control over who you talk to, of course, and, like, you have control over who you interact with, but make sure you're disciplined in that fact. Like, know that if you work out five times a week, you're going to need a guy that works out five times a week or plus or more, something that you can, like, rise to the occasion with. Someone's like, oh, like, you want to make a business? I got five businesses already. I can show you how to make a business. Like, someone that can push you on. Um, if not, build together. Like, someone that, someone that got the same mindset, like, they want to make a business, something like that. Like, they got to have the same mindset as you. Like, because if you don't, it's just going to hold you back. I've let go of a lot of different negative habits. And, like, there's some that I need to let go more of. Like, I need to practice more discipline. This is me going to the gym trying to practice discipline. And if I say I don't want to do something, I'm not going to do it. If I say I'm going to do something, I'm going to do it. So this is, like, what I'm trying to push on myself is to go even when I'm tired. Like, I was tired. I, I woke up 5, 30-something, took a shower, got to work at 7, 7 I'm supposed to be there at 7 o'clock. I usually get there at 6.45. But this week, since I got PTO the last two weeks, the last two days, for some reason I'm lazy this week because I know I, I don't really, I'm not working 40 hours. But I'm going to be more, more on time, especially, um, I forgot that I don't, I'm not even, I forgot that I have an appointment on Friday. I got two appointments on Friday. I forgot. I got two appointments on Friday. I don't know how I'm going to make them. I'm going to have to either reschedule them or figure something out because I really forgot. Thursday, I don't have this car no more. Like, once I, what's this Wednesday? I, I got to just wait after work for to pick me up. That's the reality of life. Um, I just got to wait. And I don't mind it as long as I get home. But yeah, like they were saying, Quan, all them, like they don't, they're not actual like scammers. People think they are. That's how, that's how ridiculous it is. Like they making so much money, niggas be thinking they're they're scammers. But it's whatever, bro. End of the day, they gonna get to this bag, and they gonna get it to the bag the right way, and they gonna, they're showing kids how to get to it the right way. Like he's showing kids how to get to. It. Even if people will think this and think that. He doesn't care about the perception. That's not what he's here for. He's also about God all the time. He wears the jewelry he wears. He believes in Jesus. Like, he believes... He's, I don't know. If he, he never really said he's a Christian, but I believe, like, you know, if you're a follower of God, like, somehow, you're Gucci, bro. You're good. You're good in the eyes of the Lord. You're fine. Like, I, I don't... I'm not here to, like, please man. I'm not here to please man. So, if you have to cover your ears every time I curse, you have to do... That's your business. And that's your prerogative. Like, it's your prerogative to hinder, like, hide yourself from, and shield yourself from certain things in the world. It's your prerogative. That's your business. You do that. Do what you gotta do. That's the best thing that you can do. Like, do what you gotta do. Like, yesterday, I realized something about somebody. And I don't know if it's because people keep telling me, like, this guy is not, like, uh, this preacher, basically. He's not actually godly. He's more worldly. And my first conviction about him was that because he was wearing so much Jordans and chains and he was being a black man in the word of, like, it was complicated. Like, it's as if he lives in the world and he also wants to please God. It just looks like you're very confusing. But at the end of the day, I don't know if it's my job to pass judgment on anybody, especially when they're a child of God, regardless of whatever the case may be. Like, you're going, you're going to be judged by the most high, not me. I'm not gonna be there when you there when it's judgment day for you. I'm not gonna be there. I'm not gonna be in front of you like, hey, I was there when I saw you. I'm not gonna be there because I wasn't there when you were born, bro. I'm not gonna be there. I'm not God. I can't pass judgment on nobody, especially my neighbors. That's just the point of like I always felt like I can't pass judgment on you. I gotta treat you like like I wanna be treated. And I don't wanna be treated as if like preconceived notions for other people are gonna make me hate you. So I bought these books for, about him. I won't mention his name because I don't want to like, perpetuate the idea that he's a negative human being. I personally didn't think he was negative. I don't want to... Because people get in my ear, bro, it makes me look at people certain different ways. And so I really want to take my time and like perceive him how I want to perceive him. And I'm going to read his books. And if I don't resonate with them, and I ask God one more time what he is, and he tells me the same thing, I'm going to have to go with it. Because I asked him yesterday, and I was like... Is he a negative person, God? And he was like, I know it wasn't my words and my brain going like that. I wouldn't say I wouldn't have said that. But the way the way it felt, it didn't feel like my words. And at the end of the day, I don't know. I really don't know. I'd have to sit there and sit there and sit there and be like, hmm. Maybe I should just study for my own self. And I don't really, I don't need to preach anything towards anybody. I just be myself. 
him. My actions will speak louder for me than anything else. That's how I feel. That's how I feel, bro. That's how I feel. I'm tired. I'm tired, but yeah. Make a course on scamming. I told his ass it won't be shit in there because I don't know how. I'm finna make a course about cool. scamming. Y'all subscribe. I ain't gonna see no <laughs> fucking thing in there. I would get caught quick as fuck. I don't know shit about shit. Yeah. But it, it, it's like, good. basically what I'm saying is, bro, not because I seen Quan get no McLaren at 21, y'all gonna suck some dick to get some McLaren. <laughs> don't. Bro, I didn't do that. Stay, I worked hard for this shit. That was saying. crazy. That but was crazy. Know, nah, look, but yeah, you know them crazy. little young niggas, they'll do anything. How the fuck Quan get a McLaren? Bro, stay down until you come up. Yo, bro. what? You good? Go, go. Good, right, it's time to go. Appreciate, appreciate you. Uh, so I asked ChatGPT to build me a Shopify store, and it literally said no. It yeah. Hey, it's a family method, man. If y'all want to get like us, shit, that's crazy. All right. But yeah, we lit, man. You know, we lit. We just ran another McLaren for a week. And uh, for a month, we ran it for a month. How much you ran it for, like 20, right? Yeah. Hey, come on, cut this out, because this is not supposed to be in the video. So after we bring it back, we're going to get some nails and act like we didn't rent it. Yeah. Oh, you told me we rent it? Cut this out, yeah. I'm cutting all that. So this Are you still gonna... recording, nigga? Nah, look, hey, nah. I was thinking, like, I want to rent, like, some crazy shit like that. That's what I told him. Because yeah. cause niggas don't be knowing that shit, right? So yeah. if we rent it, the internet going to think we're getting so much I got I got to unwrap the cat and then give it back. Like, but, exactly, exactly. Ah. Wait, how you wrap a car? $3,000 a day, especially for these type cars. Like, real might truck, buy, 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 buy. Might as well buy them, right? I don't think we should stop running. Nah. Nah. Nah, cause we got we gotta keep switching it up. We gonna we gonna get the houses there. Oh shit! Oh shit! What? Mama Cosy, look. My mama supported me through everything in life. She don't, she didn't see the vision at first, but she for sure was the one person I could say supported me through everything. So I just wanna say I love you, mom. I love you too. Congratulations! You gotta come pick me up. We're ready to go for a ride this weekend. Alright. We made it to the gym. LA Fitness is right over there. We made it, so we're gonna go in there, get a workout in, and get out as soon as possible. <laughs> Let's go. You thought I was for you? That nigga on munch. Nigga, eat a he ate it for lunch. Bitch on my body, I get what I want like. You thought I was feeling you? That nigga on munch. Nigga, eat a he ate it for lunch. Bitch on my body, I get what I want like. Bitch, stay bad, let's keep it a bean. Don't even mad, I'll be on the scene. Ask me if I can't fit in a jean. Use my sister, just not with a scene. I got that ready, I'm keeping it clean. Fuck with my niggas, that's not in a bean. Saying you love me, but what do you mean? Pretty ass fucking me like that on me. Bad as bitch, now you shitting me. If you ain't a body, can't sit with me. I swear to this bitch is my mini me. Sex. Niggas be dreaming. I'm from the X. Niggas be scheming. I'm on the next. Niggas not breathing. Thumb in the chair. Throw You thought I was feeling you? That nigga on munch. Nigga, eat a he ate it for lunch. Bitch on my body, I get what I want like. You thought I was feeling you? That nigga on munch. Nigga, eat a he ate it for lunch. Bitch on my body, I get what I want like. Bitch on my body, I get what I please. You know my body, I do it with ease. See what my body is telling me, please. I'm walking past me, sniffing my breeze. He jacking me, but he not my boo. He like the jewelry I wear on my boots. How can I link you when I got a shoe? Don't want your love, I just want the blue. Rapping my ass while I'm doing my dance. She he won't stare, he got shorty a fan yeah. Gotta stick to the plan He mad as fuck, I won't give him a chance But still he gon' do what I say I swear I be stuck in my ways But still he gon' do what I say I swear I be stuck in my ways You thought I was feeling you? That nigga a munch Nigga, either he ate it for lunch Bitch on my body, I get what I want like You thought I was feeling you? That nigga a munch Nigga, either he ate it for lunch Bitch on my body, I get what I want like You thought I was feeling you? That nigga a munch Nigga, either he ate it for lunch Bitch on my body, I get what I want like